वेलकम बैक टू क्वांट लैब क्वांट लैब में आपका स्वागत है इन दिस वीडियो व्हाट आई वांट टू डू इज टॉक अबाउट व्हाट इज हैपनिंग इन द स्टॉक मार्केट व्हाई डू वी सी थ्री फोर परसेंट तीन चार परसेंट का डाउनवर्ड विंड डाउन विंड विद इन टू थ्री डेज सो देर इज लॉट ऑफ रीजन एंड स्पेकुलेशन अराउंड इट एंड वील गो थ्रू दम वन वन बाय वन आई हैव कोलेटेड सम ऑफ द डेटा पॉइंट्स we'll look at each of them and towards the end of the video we'll try and see at least what i would do as an investor the idea is not to make a recommendation or a suggestion but share you my perspective of what i think is happening headed again this is more of a macro level view it doesn't address anything from a trade specific point it's mostly an analysis all right before i go further please click in the description there's lot of channel perks you can get lot of discounts there are affiliate links that would be a great way if you sign up to help me and join the membership channel tab to get access to all the code let's get started so why is the stock market crashing warren buffett has sold about 50% of his apple stock holding and uh, usually warren buffett had a significantly large apple positions like his entire stake i think about 18 20% or something like that was only apple so he has dumped about 50% of that we'll talk about that nasdaq last week was all red blood red it was like 2.5% in a single day and that's a huge dip because of that you can always expect downwind why did this happen we'll take a look at it and there's lot of reasons so recession ka to story is ongoing like there's a recession coming there's इंटरेस्ट रेट हाइक हो रहा है बोथ द स्टोरीज आर गोइंग अलॉन्ग कि इंडिया में रिसेशन का इम्पैक्ट नहीं होगा बिकॉज गवर्नमेंट इज डूइंग गुड स्टफ यू एस में जॉब मार्केट बैड है रिसेशन हो रहा है एक्सेट्रा एक्सेट्रा डेट डेफिनेशन ऑफ रिसेशन आर ऑल्सो इकोनॉमिक डेफिनेशन आर यू नो वट डे आर लाइक टू कंसिक्यूटिव क्वार्टर्स ऑफ सम सॉर्ट ऑफ निगेटिव जी डी पी ग्रोथ एंड टेक्निकली निगेटिव जी डी पी ग्रोथ का कोई मीनिंग नहीं होता स्लोइंग डाउन हुआ इकोनॉमी बट लेट से छः परसेंट से गिर के जो कोटेड नंबर है चार परसेंट पर आ गया तो यू वुड कंसिडर योर सेल्फ इन अ रिसेशन फॉर कपल ऑफ क्वार्टर्स और इफ द पीरियड इज प्रो लॉन्ग दैन कपल ऑफ ईयर्स नाउ अगेन दिस इज नॉट अ लूम एंड डूम डिस्कशन तो उसमें मेरा कोई इंटरेस्ट नहीं है आई एम अप्टिमिस्टिक इन्वेस्टर एंड आई से इन्वेस्टर बिकॉज आई टिपिकली वॉन्ट टू पार्क मनी फॉर अ लॉन्गर टर्म माई गोल्स आर मच लॉन्गर टर्म एंड विद दैट आई एम शेयरिंग दिस एनालिसिस तो यूएस का अनएम्प्लॉयमेंट रेट है इफ यू सी दिस चार्ट इट्स अ वेरी वेरी सिंपल क्लू यू कैन एनीबडी कैन ओपन एंड लुक दिस अप सो दिस इज यूएस यूनाइटेड स्टेट्स अनएम्प्लॉयमेंट रेट इफ यू लुक एट फॉर अ शॉर्ट पीरियड ऑफ टाइम इवन तो जुलाई अनएम्प्लॉयमेंट हैज बीन वेरी हायर इफ यू सी फाइव ईयर डेटा एक्सेप्ट द होल कोविड पीरियड दिस इज स्टिल पीकिंग हाई यूजली इट्स इन द रेंज ऑफ थ्री पॉइंट सिक्स But now it's growing to 4.3 percent. It's high, but ऐसा नहीं है कि दुनिया में आग लगने वाली है मतलब ठीक है something will happen. There will be rate cuts, new economic policies will come. There will be some adjustment. So it it should happen. So the labor force might get a little dissuaded. The money flowing might get a dissuaded for a little bit period of time. But this is this is like natural cycle in the world. Like job markets always keep going up and down. इसके अलावा लॉट ऑफ बिग टेक स्टॉक्स आर फॉलोइंग नाउ दिस वुड बी अ गुड टाइम टू लुक एट बिल्ड कैश पोजिशन विच आर टॉक अबाउट इन द एंड बिकॉज इफ यू सी माइक्रोसॉफ्ट कॉर्पोरेशन सो फॉर एग्जाम्पल माइक्रोसॉफ्ट शेयर प्राइस दिस हैज डिप्ट अबाउट पॉइंट फोर फोर एंड इन द पास्ट फाइव डेज इट सेल्फ इट हैज डिप्ट सिक्स क्लोज टू फाइव एंड हाफ परसेंट मंथ इज फोर्टीन परसेंट सिक्स मंथ इज नॉट दैट मंच सो सो राइट नाउ इट्स ट्रेडिंग एट अ वेरी वेरी गुड लेवल इफ यू वॉन्ट टू पिक दिस अप could be interesting if you invest in us stocks now overall this has come back to some sort of previous like 3 4 months before range so it's it's a good range there's a lot of support around 400 so you can see that it's maybe after, for it will converge or consolidate for some time similarly for other tech stocks be yahi story chal rahi hai sab mein amazon is doing the same thing nvidia is having the same thing then there's another reason which is looked at probably is this the real reason or not i don't know but uh, this is what is it there's an interesting story here so there's something called as interest rate arbitrage aur isko thoda acche se samajh lete hain so what happens is uh, the world operates in debt log paisa uthate hain kahi aur invest karte hain in japan japan was running almost at a 0% interest rate aisa kyu kar rahe the mujhe nahi pata 
but Japan lending was very easy. So the the yen was trading around 165 to 1 US dollars. So currency was a very, you know, uh, the price was very fixed running around and Japan has maintained this for 10 plus years, I think 30 years or something like that. But it was very low or almost zero interest rate. So what people will do is they'll borrow money from Japan, free ka paisa mil raha lo, aur US mein laga diya. So it's the growth, it's the dollar arbitrage that they are making money on. Now Japan has done what they have done. They have said that we will increase 25 base points. That means we will increase 0.25%. So the dollar arbitrage that people have shot and kept the currency. So that's the benefit of it. And that benefit had a cascading impact. This is what a lot of people are talking about. So long story short, multiple things happening in the global sphere. Japan currency discussion going on again there was further a news before a little before time of recording this video that they have announced like if it is impacting markets too much we will not do it very similar to like Indian government saying he will not give the indexation benefits and then they are saying it might be optional for people or something like that so god knows what will happen if they revert back the decision we might see a sudden small shot as a positive uptrend back now what Warren Buffett is doing is interesting. So oh, for the past, like if you see quarter by quarter analysis, till Q4 2022, Warren Buffett was just flat. But then he goes high, he goes low, he goes high and now is a low. So you can anticipate that since he's sitting on a lot of cash, I think there's some number that I read like 200, he had around 250 billion and right now he's sitting in around 10, 100 billion or something in cash. That's not significantly important. But what is important to understand is that there are cash positions being built by seasoned investors. And this argument can be backed in the fact that you can see a downward trend right now. There is a slow market. Beer market hai ki nahi bolna sahi hoga, nahi hoga. I think you guys are better to judge. So, so that's what is running here. Uh, finally, has he reinvested it? Not yet. The money is still out in the open. What do we know of Indian markets? So Indian markets may trading view. Uh, I mean, we at the moment we saw that two three percent dip. Indian market reacted naturally, so it came down to roughly about four percent ke karib dip kiya tha, and then again it bounced back a little bit. Uh, so it's it's around that uh, twenty four thousand three hundred range, and there are a couple of support in this area in this region if we take a look at deep dive in so 24,000 is a good support level like 24,000 to support ban sakta hai. and then there's somewhere around 24,300 also there is there is a little support and then niche ka bahut strong support hai, jahan se bounce back kiya tha. so 24,300 to 400 is where we are right now where this headed nobody knows we can only speculate what can we do right now we should not be going into overvalued stocks. Very, very basic principle. Doesn't apply right now. It applies all the time. But overvalued stocks may be nahi jana chahiye because if there is a downward wind, there should follow a consolidation phase. And each time may you might not get the benefit of that. So it would be a good idea to sit on a little bit cash for some time. I'm not saying time the market, but I what I follow is thoda thoda amount as I see my portfolio dip every time by 3%, 4%, more than 4%, I put in a little money to do downward averaging. I know that at a certain rate, like whenever Nifty is at 25,000, I'm going to be running at X percentage. So all I do is just keep on downward averaging it even if there is, you know, 3-4% of dip. Yes, if there is more dip, I will put more money in. Like 10% ho gaya, toh, there is a possibility a discussion running out. So yeah. That's a little bit of short analysis, quick 8-10 minutes of discussion. Market abhi niche ja raha hai, that's what it looks. Yeah, since this is a tech-based channel, I also did the same analysis in Python, thode AI models, I try kiye, but itna short term mein kuch pick nahi hua, to be very honest about it, it's very difficult, so better to stick to technical indicators in this case. And I think jo ek trend dikh raha after a, such a long, good bull market, वो थोड़ा सा शॉर्ट डे पा सकता है अगर 10% का डे पाया तो बहुत अच्छा पैसे ले बनाइए और पैसे कमाइए ऑलराइट अंटिल नेक्स्ट वीडियो थैंक यू बाय बाय